halfway around the world from Hollywood, is Hong Kong, a beautiful and active city for movie makers. In the last few years, Hong Kong's fascinating backgrounds have been showing up in more and more action films. And even today, a new movie is getting underway with the arrival of its star, Tamara Dobson, known to millions of action movie fans as Cleopatra Jones. The new picture is called Cleopatra Jones and the Casino of Gold. Directing is a man who has been one of the leading Hollywood makers of that kind of mayhem, riot, and catastrophe they call stunts. His name is Chuck Bales, and this is his first assignment as a major film director. citizens of Hong Kong are like people all over the world. They're fascinated by movie makers and gather in the streets to watch the crew prepare for another kind of stunt, filming speeding cars racing head to head into a grinding, shattering smash up. The director describes how he sets this one up. One of the stuntmen is speaking with the assistants on how they're going to turn over an automobile, where it's going to go, the height of the ramp, etc. A few of the police we had to hire at this scene where we would turn the car over. We had approximately 3,000 people that decided they wanted to be in the picture. Chuck Bales and his crew try to see how the stunt will look before they film it. And here's a little precaution. We like to sort of hide from the stuntman the fire extinguishers, just in case of a gasoline spill. There are some of the protection the stuntmen have to wear to keep their legs from getting broke. We were very worried about the lack of communication here, not knowing the language. One of the children could step out in front of a car, and at the speed they traveled, they could certainly get killed. It's all in a day's work to these pros, but any time a stuntman walks away from a job unhurt, everyone's relieved. The Casino of Gold is a luxurious gambling palace and the Pacific headquarters of a blonde empress of oriental crime, played by Stella Stevens. From here, this dragon lady controls a global network of murder, narcotics, and treachery. And it is here that six foot four Cleopatra Jones will meet her ultimate challenge as conceived by producer Bill Tennant and director Chuck Bales. Oh, what is this? Two beautiful ladies, unescorted. Well, my mother, trust me. Chuck Bales was in charge of the action portion of some of the biggest and most violent action scenes in recent film years. Now established as a film director himself, he is quite at home in preparing to demolish the Casino of Gold for his movie. Bill Tennant is trying to finish a scene so we can start shooting again. Here we are discussing eye makeup for Stellan Stevens. Cinematographer Alan Hume looking through the camera. My assistant talking to the stuntmen we flew over from Los Angeles to do all the motorcycle work. We feel they are the two best men in town to do this. Some of the wild cameras ever used, hopefully no one would get hurt. They were all running in slow motion. Stella on a day off came to the set to visit. She wanted to see the action. And the co-star, Mi Ling and Cleopatra Jones. There they burst through. One man accidentally goes down. Bales will shoot the scene in sections, using a specially rigged camera to film Cleopatra blasting away at her enemies. 400 people in the casino have to watch their step as the motorcycle roars up and down the aisles. To get another angle on the scene, Bales puts the cameraman in a wheelchair to film the crowd's reaction to all this mayhem.
one piece of the scene has to be shot again as the bike fails to turn over on cue. But the extras, caught up in the spirit of the action, keep on going. With our lack of communication, we couldn't get people to stop, mainly because of the language barrier. On the third try, the stuntmen come through for the director. The scene inside the casino is 11 minutes of pure action and it took five days to film. Chuck Bale sets standards that are hard to meet. He has the crew and actors rehearse again and again under the rough conditions of Hong Kong's heat and humidity. And when the impossible stunt finally comes together on the screen, it will be through the director's planning, effort, and skill. It will be an essay in Cataclysm for Tamara Dobson and a movie company making Cleopatra Jones and the Casino of Gold.